Hi, this is Kevin. Today I wanted to show you how to add simple text to a journaling card. Now in this example, I happen to be using Adobe Photoshop, but you can do the same thing using Adobe Photoshop Elements. I also happen to be using a card found in the Clementine collection of Project Life, but you can do the same thing using any cards from any collection. The first thing we need to do is choose the type tool. You can do this in one of two ways. The first way is to simply choose the type tool from the toolbar, usually found on the left hand side of Photoshop or Photoshop Elements. The second way is to simply hit the T key on your keyboard. This is a shortcut for that tool. Now that we've selected the type tool, let's check the font that we'll be using. To do that, look at the top of your screen at the font toolbar. From here, you can adjust the font type and size before applying text to your journaling card. Now that we've selected the font that we want to use, it's time to start adding text. Take the type tool, move it to the location that you want to start adding text, and click. From here, you'll get a blinking cursor. This indicates it's okay to start typing. When you're done, simply choose a different tool from the toolbar to deselect the text, and that's it. If at this point you decide that you want to move your text to a different location on the card, it's okay. We can do that. The first thing we need to do is choose the Move tool from the toolbar on the left. The keyboard shortcut for that is the letter V. Once you've selected the tool, simply use your mouse to drag and drop the text to the new location. If you want to fine-tune the location of your text, try using the arrow keys on your keyboard to nudge the text up or down or left or right. Once you've added this text, you can add additional text or even images to your journaling card. When you're done with that, you can either save the file for later use or print. To learn more about how to use Photoshop and Photoshop Elements to record your memories, visit jessicasprague.com. There are plenty of free tutorials as well as affordable in-depth classes.